<coughs> oh, excuse me. <coughs> uh, welcome to Inanimate, the Spooky Special. The Dagger series highlighting the true pioneers of the Halloween experience. No items were harmed in the making of this series. Allegedly. Viewer discretion is advised. <coughs> I was made in 1945. Are we live? Are we live? Like, like, right now? Right now? Oh, shit, shit. Hey, uh, just want to say appreciate you for having me on. It's, uh, me, the Bobbin for Apple's Bucket, a.k.a. Bobby. Yo, you know what time it is. Live from the Candy Bowl, Halloween 2023. We live in this bitch. And I've lived in this year dump since 1972. Hey, guys. Hey, guys. <laughs> Sorry, I got a chronic cough. Uh, for three-fourths of the year, I'm probably just a purposeful bucket to most, you know? Man, I've been so hyped for this moment. Every piece of candy look forward to the day, you know what I'm saying? It's like a uh, Christmas or birthday or New Year, some, something celebratory. But boy, you should have seen me in 78. Hey guys, it's your boy, one and only Broom, a.k.a. Mr. Steal Your Dirt. What I used to be. Like, you're probably going to fill me up with soap, wash your dog, take me out to the car when you feel motivated to wash your car. Time to get chose by some hoes. Well, well the kids ain't hoes, but yeah. I'm, I'm going to get picked, though. I'm going to get picked. I had both my eyes, my whole left leg. I was in my prime. Feels like it was just yesterday when I was with a rich ass family living a good life, you know. I remember I was sweeping up marble floors and being stored up in the closet with all my other cleaning supply homies. I remember picking up everything in sight. Really, I'm just that boy when it comes to holding things. My, uh. My OG Reese's made it sound like this was going to be much, much quicker. Like, like I'd be gone in a couple hours, but I'm still here. Started a punk band with some local musicians. We had a great run until I realized that they were all rats. But check this out, right? The maid was doing a thing with the cleaner, and she went to take her little smoke break and left me outside on the fucking porch. But sometimes... Folks break me out for the holiday season. See, I'm trying to lean into that side of myself. The festive side of myself. I, I know I'm going to get chose. I, I'm just getting a little anxious, you know. Dated the drummer until we had a bad fight. One night he was out drinking with the boys. He took my right eye out. A few hours passed by and it, and it, and it got a little dark. Anyways, I was minding my own Enjoying the breeze, even watching the kids go trick or treating and whatnot. That all of a sudden I felt myself getting lifted off the ground. The dunk your head up in me and grab an apple out type self. I heard if you don't get picked on Halloween, you just ain't worth nothing as a piece of candy. Cause niggas pick anything on Halloween. They not picking me though. Never saw any of those fuckers again after that night. I looked up and saw a witch staring down at me with a wicked grin on her face with a crazy ass butt chunk. She laughed and said, you'll do nicely. That guy that's like, hey, let's toss a couple mini fireballs up in there. Damn, don't nobody want no black licorice? I'm right here on top. Choose me. Pick me. Are we done here? I have an appointment with my gynecologist. Got these bumps ever since I slept with that fucking squirrel. And before I knew it, I was flying through the fucking air with the witch stank ass sitting on top of me. And we sort of mountains and valleys through the rain and snow until we finally landed in a dark and spooky forest. I'm just trying to embrace that side of myself. Hello? Hello? The witch hopped off me and said, we've had much work to do. And I was fucking horrified. Now I'm free to fly wherever I want. And 
Sometimes when the wind is just right, I can still hear it laughing in my ear. I'm getting chills right now. Can we can we just cut? Yeah, can we can we can we take a break? Action, I'm done. I'm done.